Relax, Spring. We'll share the flashlights. The park is very big. It would be best to split up to cover more places. That's a good idea. I'll go with Spring, but we'll be in contact at all times and we won't stray too far, okay? Very good. So let's go. Calm down, Bunny. The place we're going to really isn't that far away. Mmm, H. If you're going to live with me I have to stop calling you Bunny. Baby. Pistachio? Toy. Mr. Fluffy Buns? Bon Bonnie. No, no. Oh, here we are. Okay little toy, wait a moment, I won't be long. I'll be up. Bon. Did you accidentally get locked inside? Mmm, H. There is no one. God. Huh. I. I thought. He might really be here. Huh. This is starting to get very frustrating. Bon. Oh toy, it seems like you've only seen me cry. I'm sorry. I hope this whole situation passes soon. Bonnie. I wish I could tell you who I am, but at this point, after everything that has happened, I can't anymore. I'm afraid of your reaction. Oh, of what might happen. A message from Joy. It seems they didn't have much luck either. Mmm, H. We better meet up with Joy and Spring before it gets any darker. Let's go. Bonnie. What's more? Let's have a race to see who gets there first with them. Wait, what? Run toy, I'm beating you. Bob Bonnie wait. I can barely see anything. Puff. Oh my god, Bonnie. Are you okay? Why were you running like that? Oh, it's nothing. He he he, I was just... Um... Distracted, sorry. But forget about that, let's keep searching. Actually... Mr. Smith called and wants us to come back now. What? But we can't stop now. We haven't found a single clue as to where he might be. We must continue. I know, Bunny. I know. But he doesn't want us to expose ourselves anymore. It's too late already. It's dangerous. Then you go back. I'll keep looking. Calm down, bro. You have to understand the situation. I promise you that tomorrow we will all go out again to look for him. But for now we have to go back. Um, I don't really agree. But that's okay. I'll go get Toy. Yeah, <laughs> Holy. Hello everyone. I'm Princess Vanilla and today I'm going to tell you a little bit about us ice creams, along with these two sweeties as helpers. First of all, ice creams are divided into two categories, natural ice creams and artificial ice creams. Natural ice creams are made of natural ingredients, they are created with fresh fruits, sugar, milk, among other ingredients, it also depends on their flavor. Artificial ice creams also have ingredients like sugar or milk, but the difference is that they are not made with fruits, but with coloring and flavorings of these. Both types are created in a special humanoid shaped mold, their ingredients are added, and they are kept refrigerated for 5 years, they age where our bodies and tone are strong enough to start moving. Afterwards, we grow normally, and acquire the height that our bodies allow us. Our ice cream hair is also moldable to our will, and each one of us chooses the decorations that they wanted to have. Some choose fruits, sprinkles, or another detail that represents their flavor. And finally, our diet is quite simple, ice creams do not eat ice cream. Our diet consists of sweets, fruits, seeds, cookies, things with a lot of sugar. Something very important for us is that, even though we do not eat ice cream, we must eat the flavor we are made of. For example, blackberry must eat blackberries to be able to maintain its consistency. And well, artificial ones do not have to do this as much as the others, they only have to ingest a little of their flavoring and that is enough. Well, that's all you need to know for now, how he- See you soon sweeties and thanks for reading. At Bond's house. Well, we were unlucky today, but tomorrow will be another day. Once the others arrive, we'll discuss possible places to search. We won't give up. I hope they choose credible locations, because today was a total waste of time. Sorry, but I don't see any suggestions from you here. Are you really committed to this quest? Are you implying something? I'm not implying anything. I'm just telling the truth. You haven't done anything to help us. You've just complained and whined, what a way to get involved. 
Look, you better go and let us look for ourselves. No. I'm not going to leave. Me, me. Me care about Bon and I want to find him. I know I haven't done anything to help, and it's because. I don't know what to do. I've never been through anything like this. But I do care. That's why I'm here. And I'm truly sorry if I'm of no use. Uh, Toddy, I... I want to keep looking for him. Please, Toddy, stop crying. No, I didn't mean to get to this point. It seems like I only make people cry. I... I'm sorry. I'm the one who knows the cover is awful. I'm just too worried. All I want is for Bond to come back, and for him to be okay. This whole thing has frustrated me and made me explode too much. I apologize, I shouldn't have yelled at you like that. It's okay, Meg. I accept your apologies. Oh, oh, really? Yes. Thank you. I think we should stop crying and focus on finding Bob. Yes, you're right. Hey, there wasn't much stuff in the kitchen, but I brought you a couple of drinks. Huh? Did I miss something? What? What's going on? Fox. Brother. Let me go. Okay, okay girls, you can't be so impulsive, let's take it easy, this will be resolved, just stop crying already. They've arrived. Okay, that's enough with you two, go sit there calmly and don't even think about moving. You guys took a long time to get here, you have no idea what I've been through. Huh? Hmm, nothing, nothing, just ignore me look, you better go sit down while I get you something to drink. I just hope that's a more this for the two. Meg, but why does this one have to sit next to me? Mm -hmm. Mage. Hey Mag, you've been crying, haven't you? What? And who do you think you are to ask me that? Calm down, calm down. I'm not telling you this to make you angry. What I mean is... I get it, this is a really tough situation for everyone, so you don't have to hold back and act strong if that's not how you feel. Listen. I know we're not friends, and I don't know if we ever will be. But you should know that even if you don't want to, I'm in this with you, and I'm going to support you and everyone else. Oh Bonnie. I'm sorry, if I was very rude to you. Thank you for those words Bonnie. I appreciate them very much, I also don't know if we will ever be friends, but for now, we are together in this.